hundreds of mourners gathered outside City Hall in San Jose to honor the innocent lives that were lost there. God took my best friend husband too soon. The crowd heard loved ones, friends, and co-workers share stories and memories of the nine VTA employees. KPIX5's Marie Medina was there. I once was lost. I'm the wife of Tim Roma. My name's Nicole, and I'm Paul's wife. Was blind. My name is Audrey. I'm his daughter. In front of thousands, the families of some of yesterday's mass shooting victims stood together, united in their loss and heartache. My dad was a selfless man. As a veteran, I know my dad wouldn't run from, away from the danger. When he heard the shots, when he saw that everybody's life in danger, his first reaction was to tell other people. The final moments of their lives told by those who survived, including Tap Teach Deep Singh's heroic efforts to save his co-workers instead of running from the gunfire. He was calling his co-workers, telling them to hide under the benches, figuring out what to do, how he can help. Paul Magia, an assistant superintendent, also reportedly saved a co-worker's life by telling her to hide in his office. Tomorrow he was supposed to go to Disneyland, and, and that day, yesterday, he wasn't even supposed supposed to go to work. He was supposed to work at home. And I, w I was going to have breakfast with him. The bravery and selflessness in the face of danger at a workplace many love to go to every day, according to relatives. They say the VTA was like family. Just so everybody can see, you know, He's a great person, always smiling. Tonight, their lives remembered, and a community mourning alongside the families of the nine who died. Families who will never understand the tragedy that unfolded Wednesday morning. Never leave home without giving your loved one a kiss goodbye. Because that was the last I got. God took my best friend husband too soon. And I'm wishing I could give him one last hug and tell him how much I love you. I love you always. Maria, these stories about the victims' lives are touching, they're heartbreaking. Did you hear anything else tonight? Yeah, you know, Timothy Romo's children said he was a handyman and a jokester, and uh, mm -hmm. Mr. Singh's younger brother said that he once told him it's not about having physical strength, but having a lion's heart. Yeah, no question that these were remarkable people. Thank you, Maria.